we attend to the whole person with a uh, attention to the spiritual. Um, many, many places talk about caring for the whole person, but they do not provide the resources to address spiritual care of patients. Catholic hospitals take that very seriously to um, focus also on the spiritual care of patients. Because whenever someone is sick, I mean, if you just even get a cold, <laughs> everything's affected. How you relate to people, how you feel about yourself that day. Um, so you can imagine people in a hospital setting um, also being affected at a deeper level, perhaps, than just a cold that day. We have a chapel mm -hmm. that's located uh, in the hospital that anyone is welcome to come to. We have on the altar a paper where they can list prayers that they're asking for, and then every day the chaplains will look at that list and make sure that that day they're thought of in prayer. I came here from um, Youngstown, Ohio, and did private duty throughout the city, and I went to all the hospitals, but when I walked into St. Francis, I felt like I was at home. And I knew after um, I went to nursing school and came back as an RN that I wanted to work here. Now, I am Catholic. Um, I do believe in the Catholic health care ethic additionally, and that was important to me as well. But seeing the crosses and all the rooms and having sisters here, it just, even for those of us who are not Catholic and work here, it really seems to make a difference, and I think our patients love hearing the prayer every morning. I mean, there are not many places you can just, you can pray in the morning. Mm -hmm. And so, um, I truly believe that health care is a ministry, and I feel that in any capacity, that you work in in healthcare, you're ministering to the sick, and you know, you can be paid for that. But there's no pe better paycheck than the gratitude. And when you go home at the end of the day, you know that you've done something good for for people.